This is Clarence Hill and Shereen Williams coming to you from Cowboys Training Camp. The day before, Sunday before, we have the great showdown battles in practice with the St. Louis Rams. They will be here Monday and Tuesday to go against the Cowboys. Certainly, there's going to be some ratchet up intensity for these things. The bad news for the Cowboys is the guys who won't be around, the number of injured guys who won't be able to participate. There's Des Brown. Of course, he's been out. He won't be able to go. Tyron Smith, a Doug Free, Orlando Scandrick, Brandon Carr, Tyron Crawford mispracticed today. He may or may not go. He has a strain back. The same thing with Anthony Hitches. Sean Lee mispracticed. It was more of a rest day. He could go, but that still hasn't been decided. You got Darren McFadden running back who returned to practice. They're kind of bringing him along slowly. He, not, he, he may not be able to go. The big thing today was Byron Jones, the number one draft pick, went down with a shoulder injury. He's going to be out for at least a week, and he won't be able to participate. Yeah, Clarence, there's going to be a lot of people missing from this practice, but we know it's coming. Let's get ready to rumble. There's going to be some fights, and we're going to enjoy watching that. I'm sure there's a big fight out here today between the Cowboys' own players. Started with uh, Tyler Klutz and Jeff Heath got into it, and it's going to be even ratcheted up, as you said. Yeah. Tomorrow we remember the Raiders' fight when they were here last year. Fans were jumping over the fence, J.J. Wilcox, and so we're going to have some of that tomorrow. There's no doubt. They, they look forward to practicing against other teams and a lot of testosterone yeah. out here. The Cowboys had at least four fights, melees between themselves. They had a big one today, again, you talked about, so you know it will be chippy when they're going against another team and the guys that want to protect their own guys. Jeff Fisher, Jason Garrett, the coaches, are not condoning this, okay? They don't condone fighting, but they do like to see their co teams compete with passion and certainly protect each other and stand up for each other. So, again, let's get ready to rumble.